Check, check, one, two, three, four, according to purposes, if I can get your name, please, and the Polaris Music Prize shortlist album. Yes, my name is Shad, and the album is called A Short Story About a War. Let's do this, coming down in three, two, one. Chad, it's always a pleasure speaking with you. Um, this is incredible because when I think about the Polaris Music Prize, I always think about when you hosted it, my friend. And didn't you wear a certain kind of... You describe what I'm talking about when you hosted. Well, it was 2013, so it was like a jump off of the uh, Miley Cyrus uh, VMAs with Robin Thicke, I yeah. want to say it was. Yeah. So I was wearing, I don't remember exactly, but it wasn't a lot. <laughs> it burns into my brain on that. But what also burns in my brain is the fact that you've always been able to put out incredible music. Uh, the Players Music Prize is... Uh, how many times have you actually been on this shortlist, man? It's been a lot of times. Yeah, this is my fourth time. When you think about that and knowing that the music critics um, put you in that type of establishment, how do you feel with that, especially um, because you're a leader in the hip-hop community? Yeah, I, I feel really, really grateful, you know, um, just to get to keep making stuff because that's what I love to do and then to know that it's heard and felt in, uh, it's heard and it's felt is amazing because this is, this is what I like to do. Um, so yeah, I just feel incredibly grateful, you know, and, and proud. I'm here with a lot of the same people I've been working with since the first time I was shortlisted. So uh, it's a wonderful feeling. What was this album about for you? What did it mean for you putting this together then? And what does it mean for you now, once again, being on that shortlist? The album is, uh, I've been saying this, the album is about fear. And uh, it's, it's a deep album for me, you know, like now that um, making it gets further and further from memory, it gets harder and harder to hold on to exactly what inspired it. But um, yeah, the album to me is about fear and it's about what happens when we live out of fear and the um, false realities we see when we live out of fear. It's interesting. Yeah, that's kind of what it's about, you know. Um, and those false realities, collectively lead to something like a war where we hurt each other and where we run away from each other instead of embracing each other you know this false reality of seeing each other as like enemies and in competition instead of brothers and sisters which is the truth like the actual literal truth you know um, so that's what the album is about what kind of emotional ride was it for you putting this together? Because just hearing the subject, it, it must have been one of those where I could imagine you at certain points just pausing yeah. just to collect yourself. Totally. The, the, the real challenge for this album for me, which was like a real, um, well, it was, it was a fun challenge, but it was a challenge nonetheless, was just holding on to that idea that I just described, you know, the story. Um, and try to translate it into music every day, like, keeping that focus because there's so many details in making music there's the hi-hat and the snare and the bass and the guitar you know to try and hold on to but this is what i'm trying to say with all of those individual elements was a, was the real challenge for me yeah. 2019 it's not over yet what's going on with the rest of this year and what's going to happen with 2020 with you yeah working on new music um more hip-hop evolution coming uh, so that's the next little while. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it, man. Social media, where do we go to follow you? Yeah, you can find me at Shad K Music, um, S H A D K Music, on um, Instagram, Twitter. Yeah, my friend, have a great time tonight. Good luck. I'm hoping four is the magic number for you. Thanks, Rudy.